Hey everybody, welcome back to Final Fantasy VII. So, in between videos, I, uh, I was trying to record uh, the side missions before we move on to the next thing, and I ended up losing out on about an hour's worth of gameplay because my uh, streaming software that I, or recording software that I use is a little bit glitchy for some reason, and I ended up losing the video that I recorded, sadly. So all I did was the four, I think there was about four side missions that I ended up losing out on. And out of them, I think the only story related thing that I think is that's worth mentioning is that the one teacher in here basically mentioned that Biggs was a teacher, which is really cool. Uh, other than that, it was basically fighting monsters and stuff like that. Um, a couple things and people kept saying they saw people walking towards Aerith, uh, her mom's house. Um, but one thing I do want to do, because I did increase the difficulty and I was able to squeeze my way through and beat the boss, but I have to put it on, like I struggled so much. I have to put it on easy for my first playthrough just because I'm not used to the, the game. I don't know. I just can't get the hang of it. I don't, I don't know what it is, but it was insanely hard. So I'm going to continue playing it on easy just to get through the story before Rebirth comes out and then we'll see how it goes from there. So this is the guy they're talking about, I guess. Hello, Aerith. What do you want? His name's Rude. Haven't seen him before. He your new boy toy. He's my bodyguard, if you must know. Wait a minute those eyes is he the one who beat up reno and what if i am need to cross my t's dot my eyes that's all cloud leave him be rude's not a bad person really no i'm not bad but like it or not, I sometimes have to do bad things. Oh, he looks cool anyway. I don't remember him from the original, so you must don't meet him later on. Personal. Oh my god. I have a feeling this is going to be tough. These are all the same. All bark, no bite. You'll want to talk. So he's a Turk. Oh, oh my goodness. Okay. See, when I was fighting the giant robot thing, I was basically not doing any damage at all, which really bugged me. And then even doing the ex exploiting the weaknesses and stuff like that, I just kept dying, and I don't know. I know there are strategies and stuff, and I know it's kind of silly to play it on easy mode, but it's honestly a hard game. So like easy mode is too easy, normal mode is hard basically for me. Okay. So you had enough yet? He had an extra pair of glasses. I don't believe that I have. See, it would be nice if we if we could put it on a difficulty that's sort of in between easy and normal. Think about changing careers. Uh, let's assess him actually. Allow me. See if that counts. I see you. So let's use a thunder. Cloud's pretty strong, isn't he? Thundara. Oh yeah, that did good damage. Damn it! There's just no... Holy crap! See, even on easy mode he's tough. Do we have our limit break? Oh my god. Let's limit break him, this is ridiculous. Oh wow, that did a ton. Like I say, easy mode is too easy, no, and but this is 
normal mode is too hard, but that's okay. I, I'd rather it be easy at this point, especially for recording purposes, if we're not going for the platinum yet. We might as well not struggle Please, too much. Just leave us alone. You know I can't do that. <clears throat> hey there, partner. I'm sure you're having the time of your life, but we're needed on standby for a job. Something about Sector 7. So get your ass back here now. Understood. Got somewhere else to be? Apparently so. Go home and stay there. You know I can't do that. So they obviously have some history there, which is interesting. This might be my favorite location, I think. I wonder if there's a materia still around here. In the original, there was one in her garden, I think, if I remember correctly. Maybe that's where we're going now. Yep, there's one. Talking to the So yeah, it was that kind of day. <sighs> Let's go. Shouldn't keep mom waiting. Hey. What'd they say? Good work today, guys. Kidding. They didn't say a word. But you know. Uh, never mind. It's not like you'd believe me after all. Hmm. Probably not. <laughs> Tell me anyway. Really? Yeah. It won't be much longer now. The flowers, they... They have something important to tell us. Something they need to share with us. At least, that's the feeling I get. But before they can, there's a final step that has to be taken. Otherwise, we won't hear them. Maybe I should just give up. Honestly, it's what I do best. Could have fooled me. From what I've seen, you're no quitter. Well, today's special. That's why I've been working my butt off. Uh, what's so special about it? <laughs> okay, time to go. to talk to her did the flowers say anything uh good work today guys <laughs> that's the spirit well, that was a good moment grab this quickly mp uh, mp up materia i think we already have one 
really like. I wonder if we can equip two of them. I think we'll keep what we have for now on her. Yeah. Yeah. That's enough for one day. Where have you two been? Uh, I've been worried sick. Sorry. We got a little sidetracked. Dinner's ready, in case you're wondering. Ah, great. But before we sit down, I want you to make up the guest room. Gotcha. Take a load off. Okay. <laughs> Judging by those eyes, I'm guessing you're a soldier. Ex-soldier. I hate to ask, but would you leave tonight without any fuss, no questions? You boys made a trade, a normal life. For power. You can't have it both ways. I'm back. Good. Now, I hope you're hungry. Starving, right? <sighs> I've never been so proud. The man you've become. Women must be hounding you day and night. Not really. You know, there's all kinds of temptations in the big city. I'd feel a lot better if I knew you'd found a good girl. One who'd make sure you didn't get into trouble. I can take care of myself. An older, more mature girl. I could keep you on the straight and narrow. And tell you when you're being a silly goose. That's the perfect type for you, I'd say. Stay my welcome. Poor Cloud. In the original, we had to be quiet trying to leave. I wonder if we have to. Oh, yeah, sneaking out. What? What, what, did, I, what did I hit? <clears throat> Nothing. Did you have a bad dream? Don't worry, you'll feel much better in the morning. <laughs> I promise to take you straight home. Oh my uh, goodness. Okay. Try again, I guess. What did I run into? I didn't even see anything. Please don't let her hear me again. I'm gonna turn the camera, see if I can see. What was it? Oh, there's a bucket right beside me. Look at this, who placed all this stuff? You're leaving? So, how do I get to Sector 7? It's simple enough. Just cut through Sector 6. It isn't exactly safe, but you should be okay, seeing as you're a soldier. Was one. Promise me, you'll never talk to Aerith again. Please. You got it. Thank you. Well, that's kind of sad, actually. Poor Cloud just can't catch a break sometimes. Okay, where are we going this way, likely? Yeah. Well, I'm a little surprised with this game. I was I was expecting a bit more of like a 
grindy almost. Like, I expected to have to do more grinding, I guess. Which is strange. But the way they did, I actually really like the way they... You sort of level up as the story goes, doing side missions and stuff. I think is a good way to... To remove... Although I'm not a person who actually dislikes grinding, so... It is a bit of a disappointment not being able to do that, but... I mean, we did have the one area where we could keep fighting enemies, but... Not sure if you can actually level up there. Oh my god. Cuts him off. Well, look who it is. Talk about a coincidence. What are you doing here? Waiting. I guess she knows a shortcut or something. Because I'm not sick of you yet. <laughs> Lead on. Then. Chapter nine, there we go. With pleasure. Well we basically just started, so we're obviously not gonna end the video here. Back in the party, sweet. You can see the sky. They're still working on the new plate. I don't like this part of Midgar. Back when they were still building Midgar, there was an accident and the plate fell. People had only just started moving in, so there weren't a lot living there at the time, but. And that's the underside of Sector Six, Wall Market, a real special place. But I'm sure you already knew that, right? I didn't tell you. I enlisted pretty much right after I left home. Don't know much about this place or any of the slums. Well, it took a lot of people to build Midgar, and they all needed to blow off steam. So some traders built an entertainment district. Inns, shops, bars, the works. Folks started pouring in from all over. Business was booming, money was flowing, which attracted the attention of some guys who didn't much care for the law. Now there is a name. Right. But instead of trying to solve the problem, the government decided to just wall it in. And that's how Wall Market began. Out of sight, out of mind, as the old saying goes. For the folks in charge, there's no better way to deal with it. So it's like a giant veil. Yeah. Want to see what's behind it? Not really. That's good. Because I know a better way to get to Sector 7. One that, tragically, doesn't go through Wall Market. And it's just through this tunnel here. At least it was, back when I was a kid. Well, I'm actually really excited for the wall market portion of this game. I really want to see all the changes they made. I'm guessing we'll get there soon. Maybe one or two more chapters, hopefully. Oh. Two potions. Your slow running isn't cool, Cloud. Come on. It's like a broken highway. It's been like collapsed this, expressway. You know, ever since the plate fell. So it's just gonna be. It'll be an adventure. Hard to navigate like in the original. Oh. Let's do this. Yeah. And there's that one done. Oh, I gotta assess the... I keep forgetting to assess things. It's actually kind of 
bugging me that I keep forgetting. Okay, let's assess. We may have already done the Drake. Okay. I'm just gonna do it just in case if there's all of a sudden more battle intel that requires assessing in the future. Level up. What's that? A big arm. Kinda cute, don't you think? Uh. One thing I am actually tempted to do, um, just while I'm working my way through this game, um, I'm tempted to actually restart by myself again, like, oh, great. while not oh, recording, and just, matter. like, create a new save file, basically using a walkthrough so I don't miss this. anything. That way I can get ready to play it on hard mode, and hopefully maybe learn some techniques or something like that that I can do a little bit better. What am I doing? I don't... Oh. Okay. Left, raise lower arm, right, rotate arm, circle to have Aerith climb on. Okay. Here's an idea. I'll hop on and you give me a ride. You serious? Absolutely. I'll throw down the ladder for you to climb up after. Climb on then. Well done, Aerith. Well done. You did it. Yeah. Uh. Hmm? All right, good enough. Let's keep on trucking. Hmm. Kind of left her hanging there. Stop. What is it? Oh. What are those called again? Sweeper prototype. Come on, Aerith. Get an ability so you can... Or, uh... I'm gonna give lightning to Cloud, I think. Honestly. Because everything seems to be weak to lightning. Okay, let's do that quick. We'll switch the lightning. How do you remove square? We'll give her fire. And we'll give cloud lightning. We have a two star lightning, I think, somewhere. There it is. Good. Someone blocked it off because of all the monsters that kept showing up. Pretty dangerous place for kids to play. Raised in the slums, remember? You're tough. Hmm. That's supposed to be a compliment. Really good music in this section, actually. Second, oh, it's 
seahorses. I hope we don't have to fight these. Hey, ah, darn it. You can grab that container with the arm. Raise lower, yeah, same thing. I get it. Okay, grab the container. Now what's that going to do? Not half bad. So do you moonlight as a crane operator or something? Yeah? Give her a high five. He's so mean. I think it's because her mom told him to stay away from her, I think. So tough. Lucky for me, you'll make this easier. Yes, ma'am. Well then, I'm gonna head down. Okay, this is going right here, I think. Okay, now we need Aerith. And place her. What do we got? Please be something good. Binding material. Gotcha. What is that? I wonder how many more of these puzzles we'll have to do. Echo Mist. Nice, another Mega Potion. Can't go that way. Cloud, over here. Let's quickly look at that Materia, see what it is. Um, we'll just look here. What was it called? Binding. You sleep. That's actually really good. Do I want to replace what I have? Not at the moment, I don't think. Ah, so tough. We need more materia slots is what we need. Or another party member. Too fast, okay? Got it. Where the heck is this leading us? I think we're going the 
way we're supposed to. Yeah. So maybe this was a hidden area. I'm definitely going to have to add this soundtrack to my Spotify. It's so good. Anybody around? Guess it's just us. Mm. It's still warm. Should we relight it? Have our own campfire? <sighs> I need to get back. Besides, looky here, boys. Caught us some burglars. Coming into our homes and stealing our shit. Doing crime. <laughs> I'd say we're on compensatory damages. <laughs> Capital innocent composite. I don't get it. Ah, how stupid can you be? It's crazy simple. <laughs> compensatory damages is like, uh, it's like compensation. For damages! Oh yeah! <laughs> That's what you get when you... Uh, when somebody else... We uh, haven't done anything wrong. Yeah, we were just passing through. Oh, a likely story. <laughs> okay, what do you want? Nothing but our due recompense. That's all. <laughs> due recompense! Due recompense! Huh? Due, due recompense? Uh, no shit, bro brains. Due recompense. It's like, uh... uh it's like... Uh, Compensatory damages! Um, oh, so <laughs> I think we've heard enough. Obviously these guys are gonna be Yeah. Well Oh he just stole from us. them talking. I think it's the wall market theme playing right now. Shit! Let's get the hell out of here! Wait, you guys! Don't leave me! I'm coming! Random question, but why did you quit being a soldier? That is random. You don't have to tell me if you don't want to. Uh. Um, did you have any soldier friends? Any war buddies? No. Not really. Oh, okay. No, well, there's more. Huh? What we got here? Fresh meat to test our Oh, that guy's a bit tougher. Damn it. Thunder on the... Come on. Oh, we got a blue one there. On oh, we got Stupid two brothers. arms to use. Always out of reach. Okay, Cloud, heading down. You're in charge of the arm. Got it? Well, I'd really like to get that materia. Let's try this here. Um Okay, it's not looking like I think I have an idea if we put so yeah this thing if we put it 
over here. That other arm should be able to grab it, hopefully. No? Can't place it? Are you kidding me? I can't place it down? Well... I don't get it then. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. There is literally... Nothing for me to do then. Oh, there's one here. Didn't even see it. Well, this one can obviously be used to grab the materia. Now grab, grab Aerith. No, it's a blue one, and I think the blue ones are good. Magnify materia. Gotcha. Well, what is that going to do? I wonder if we can... Okay, do I have to I'm trying to think what what is the goal here? Where do we I mean I think I get it. Hang on. We'll just get her down first. I'm gonna take a wild guess and say we have to stack the two containers on top of each other somewhere. So if we take this one. We're actually, I guess this would allow us to pick up Aerith with the other arm. I think. We'll see if this works. If not, I might have to Google something, maybe. Okay, now over here, can we let her off on top? Yes, we can. I mean, I don't know why we wouldn't be able to just put two of them, put the two hands together. But, it's alright. Now, lower this one. No? Oh, for crying out loud. <laughs> I almost crushed her to death. Let's see if we can keep her on the arm and then control the other arm. Or do we have to let her down somewhere? Now we gotta let her down somewhere. Damn it. Can we put her down on here? 
No. Oh. I can put her down right there. Now switch arms. So I needed both in order to pick her up with this arm. Try stacking the containers. Well, I had the right idea. What a headache of a puzzle this one is. Drop off now. Now the other hand should be able to pick her up. Switch arms. There. Thanks for the lift. I'll have that ladder down for you in a sec. Well, that was fun, but hopefully it's the last one. I'm done with the cranes. Let's quickly look around over here. Nope. Sure did. Uh. Huh? Wait a minute. Did you just... Nope. <laughs> so awkward. Don't worry. We'll be on the same page next time. What are you talking about? I'm sorry, okay? Hold it right there, Oh. <laughs> you want to pass through our territory? Oh, for crying out loud. Every time. That's a long... <laughs> All right, there it is. The gate to Sector 7. Looks shut. How do we open it? More importantly, how about we take a break? Sound good? No. I don't have time. Up there looks nice. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> you know, a long time ago, I used to sell flowers here. Oh yeah. Cloud, you were a soldier first class, right? 
Yeah. Weird. Really? What's weird about it? Nothing. Just that you were the same rank. Huh? As who? The first guy I ever loved. <sighs> What's his name? You probably know him. Okay. Oh. Wow. Uh. Your eyes. Oh. It's because of the Mako. All soldiers have them. Yeah. I know. Sorry. I'm bumming you out. We should go. <sighs> Gotta look forward, not back. So I have a bit of a guess who she's talking about. That was the first person she loved, but I don't know if I know for sure. Okay. Hmm. <laughs> Can we use any other? Can't play on the swings. Here. Mm -hmm. This won't take long. Wanna get to Sector 7 in style? This is the passageway for you. So... <laughs> Go ahead. You gonna be okay getting home? And if I said I wasn't? I'll go with you. I thought you needed to get back. <laughs> Don't worry. I have a backup route for emergencies. And it's safer, too. <laughs> Guess this is it, then. Ready? Let's go. Yeah. Lost you. What's going on? Shh. I'll explain everything later. But now I'm on my way to see Don Corneo. You should head back to Seventh Heaven, meet up with the gang. But I'll be fine. You've seen how much ass I can kick. I have. you don't you're going after her she's a big girl she can handle the likes of him and worse uh-uh you don't know corneo it doesn't matter how strong or smart you think you are he'll find a way to turn it against you and where is she going to meet him a mansion filled with his goons come on aren't you worried what might happen in there you have to help her Okay. So this Come is on, it, I think. Are we at? Hurry. 
Are we in Wall Market already? It looks like we are. There's the chocobos. Hey there. Where are you headed? You gave a ride to a girl earlier. Do you have any idea where she went? No, and if you don't need a ride, then get the hell out of here. Can't you see I'm trying to work? Can't say I can, no. Hmm. <laughs> What'd you say to me, you What's all the ruckus out here? Hmm. I don't know you. What's your story? We're looking for a girl who took one of your carriages. Can you help us find her? Depends. What do you want with this girl here? I guess. We want Kinda to sounds like Sam Elliott, if I'm being honest. Life without this handsome guy. Huh? So, that's how it is, huh? Well, I get a lot of customers. Hard to keep track of them all. This girl, what she look like? Well... Um, what she, I guess we'll say she's in great shape. She's in great shape. Is that really important? Wait a minute. You're talking about Tifa? That's her. <laughs> oh, looks like someone's got a bit of a crush. Hate to break your heart, kid, but it's going to be a long while before she sees the light of day again. What do you mean? She's a real pretty girl. Corneo's hosting another audition, and Tifa was chosen as a candidate. An audition for what? For the title of the next Mrs. Corneo. She's what he likes all rolled into one sweet package. Having scouted girls for so long, I know his taste better than my own. And considering those tastes, I can guarantee you this. She won't be walking out of that mansion anytime soon, if at all. So where can we find this Don Corneo? What are you asking for? Thinking of raising holy hell or something? Do what you gotta, but leave me out of it. I told you what you want to know. Now take a walk. Oh, and there goes our best lead yet. <sighs> Maybe we'll have better luck in town. Let's check it out. Yeah, well if that wasn't Sam Elliott, I'd, I'd be very surprised. Sounded exactly like him. Oh wow, look at that. Somehow this is exactly how I thought it would look. Welcome to Wall Market, the pleasure capital of Midgar that's got everything for everybody. Couple, huh? It's all good. Play together, do your own thing, earn a little stretch on the side even. Whatever you're into, we got you. Got a special one-time limited offer. No, thank you. Come on, Cloud. Let's go. Well, before we jump into this section, guys, because this is going to be really fun and I'm probably not going to want to stop playing. So I'm going to go ahead and end the video here. Uh, but when we come back, we will most likely play for quite a while, hopefully get this entire section done. Uh, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.